Good morning, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Food is Life. This is Felicia Nicole, and today I am bringing you some good old smothered cabbage that was taught to me by my very southern dad. So if you'd like to know the recipe, please stay tuned. Reduced sodium chicken broth, a little Larry seasoning salt, some slap your mama and it already contains salt, red pepper, black pepper, and garlic. And we're going to use some smoked paprika. And the absolute star of the show, the cabbage. A whole onion. And I had a little bit of red bell pepper left over, so I'm going to use that some garlic, some green bell pepper, and a half pack of bacon. Now I'm chopping up my onions, bell peppers, and garlic. Now I will be removing the outer layers of the cabbage. It's really tough and we don't want to eat that. We're also going to be removing the core of the cabbage. It's also really tough and it doesn't cook well. So we're going to remove that and cut up the cabbage and wash it well in warm running water. Make sure to fry your bacon hard because it will soften as the cabbage smothers. Once the bacon has fried hard, you're going to remove it from the skillet, but you're going to reserve the bacon grease so you can fry your vegetables and it'll also help season your cabbage with a nice smoky and bacon flavor. Now I'm giving my vegetables a little seasoning. Once your vegetables have cooked down a bit, maybe about 10 to 15 minutes, you're going to add your bacon back to the pan. Once the bacon has been fully incorporated into the vegetables, we're going to add our cabbage now. Now I'm adding a little liquid, a little chicken broth to the skillet. We don't want to add too much because the cabbage makes its own liquid. And then we're going to place a lid on our skillet and allow the cabbage to smother. Now I'm adding some Slap Your Mama smoked paprika and pepper to the cabbage. 
We do not want our cabbage to be bland. Amen. We're going to add the lid back to the skillet and allow the cabbage to wither and get very soft. The entire cooking process takes about 30 minutes. And there you have it beautiful people. This cabbage is well seasoned. It has a great rich smoky flavor that comes from the bacon. And if you would like to add additional flavor, you can fry up a few pieces of smoked sausage along with the bacon, or you can add a couple drops of liquid smoke to your cabbage while it's cooking. Well, I thank you guys for watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. God bless you. And I love you.